don't mind me I look very crazy but this is just a little update I was actually meant to update you before but I forgot the film so this is just phone quality but I'm taking a little break off of social media because I realize I'm just spending way too much time on it um so I'm gonna take some time off of social media like uploading and like on social media um one of the real reasons is that a lot of times when I'm editing my videos I get really bad motion sickness and it's annoying because I really like editing my videos but I don't like the motion sickness that I get and yeah even when I do use my tripod a lot I still get like bad motion sickness which is annoying and it does upset me so I don't know um if I I don't know as well as another thing, I'm not really sure if I'm enjoying my content or what kind of content I want to make. I know a lot of people like the body hair content. That's the one that gets most of the views, which I'm grateful for that. Thank you. <clears throat> but I don't know if it's what I enjoy. I like aspiring people, but I don't... I don't think I would be able to always um, film the like body hair videos because I just I think I would just run out of ideas too quick. Um, yeah, so I'm kind of not really sure at the moment. So I thought the best thing to do would take a little break off of social media, like off of YouTube, because sometimes, because now YouTube's kind of turning into like um, TikTok. TikTok. and what the main reason I deleted TikTok was well one because it was very negative but two was because it was a constant scroll you would always be um on it like it will feel like you're not on it for very long but you end up looking at the time and you're on it for hours and because it's a constant scroll the video is very short so you get it through so many not like YouTube or what YouTube used to be but now because of the YouTube shorts it's um yeah a bit more addictive now so YouTube knows what they're doing but that was the main reason I one of the main reasons I deleted TikTok was because I was on it because it was addictive and now YouTube's doing the shorts which is also addictive because you're on uh, and sometimes when you come across a bad video you don't like because you've been on it too much it then recommends at least to me it then recommends other videos that are kind of similar or negative and I don't like that um so I know there's an option where you can like click the thing of what like if you're not interested in this video but I don't know if there's an option to turn off YouTube shorts if there is that would be great I would like that um, so yeah, I'm just taking a little bit like a break off of YouTube and social media just to, I guess, refresh my mind and see what I really want to enjoy. I think I'm going to actually in this break work more on my comics since normally when I do my editing, I don't work on other things because the editing takes a long time and I'm very stubborn and I want to get that all done in one go, which is probably not healthy and probably the main reason why I get um, bad motion sickness. But at the same time, sometimes I'm only at the computer for a little bit and then I get bad motion sickness as well, which is not good. Um, I know that like big YouTubers or social media people, whatever you want to call them, have a whole team behind them for editing and all that, but I don't know if I would do that in the future. I know it would help me personally because of the motion sickness, but then I feel like that wouldn't be my content anymore. I feel like it would be someone else's, but <laughs> I don't know. This is what I feel. I know there's a lot of youtubers who do that anyway but yeah i just wanted to pop in sorry i keep looking at here it's on my phone so <laughs> trying to look there but yeah so i'm just taking a little bit of a break of a social media and i'll see you whenever i see you again i'm not sure how long i'll be up for but i want to uh, a couple of weeks but i'll see you whenever i see you i'm eternal marie and bye